Hi everyone, it's Miss Broad and this is a lesson on how to write the days of the week. Now I've been thinking about this because writing the days of the week can be really tricky. So my class came up with some funny ways of saying the days of the week which helped them to remember how to spell them. So I thought I'd come on here and share them with all of you. Now the first thing that you need to remember is that all of the days of the week end with day. So if you can remember how to spell day, you're already half the way there on learning how to write them. So just remember that day starts at the dinosaur's bottom. It goes round the dinosaur's bottom, up his long neck and down to his feet. And then it's the phase five way of writing digraph A. It's those two letters, A and Y, making the one sound A. It's an alternative way of making the A sound. So once you've done that and you've remembered how to spell this part, you can get started with writing the rest of them. So the first day of the week is, can you remember? Monday. Now it's not spelt Monday, it's spelt mon day. So my class like to do a deep voice and say mon day. So I'm going to do that now. Now remember, all of the days of the week are names, so they all have to start with a capital letter. So, Mon Day. Now the next one's Tuesday, and sometimes people think it starts with a ch sound, but it doesn't. It starts with a T. T. And then it's U. So phase five sound again, t u s day. So we have mon day and t u s day. Now the next one's my class's favourite. They like this one best. It's Wednesday, and it's spelt wed nes. Day. So we have mon day, t u s day, and wed nes day. Do you know what comes next? It's Thursday. Now some people think this starts with an F, but it absolutely doesn't. It starts with the digraph. And then sometimes they think it's a phase three er. And it is, but they often get the wrong one. It's this one. Uh. Now, my class like to really stick their tongue out when they're saying this because we're doing it in silly ways. It's the only time I let them do it. And they go, uh, day. So we have mon day, t use day, wed nes day, and uh day. What comes next? It's Friday and my class like to remember it by saying i day, friday, mon day, use day, wednes day, earth day, friday. What comes next? It's sat. Uh, now you have to remember it's the same er uh as this one. It's not an a. Ah. Sat er uh, day, Monday, t use day, wednes day. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and the last one we like to go like this to remind us that it's Sun Day. We do an action for that one. So those are all of the days of the week, and you can see they all end in day. And if you can remember how to spell them using some silly voices and silly ways of saying it, that will really help you 
to remember how to spell them. So let's just read them together in a silly way first. Mon day t use day Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday and Sunday. So let's just read them properly now as well, just to make sure. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven days of the week. Have fun making up some silly ways of learning how to spell it. Bye for now.